Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Ayrshire Fiddle Orchestra's virtual festive celebration. That was the orchestra performing John Mason's Fiddlers to the Fore at Kinkase Church back in August, when we had our first face-to-face -face rehearsal in almost 18 months. Sadly, tonight we are not in our town hall celebrating our Christmas concert, but instead we are back in our homes and the virtual music world. Given the latest restrictions, our Christmas concert this year has been postponed, not cancelled. So watch this space and hopefully we'll see you all back in Air Town Hall soon. In the meantime, I hope you enjoy our festive celebration and I'm delighted to introduce the orchestra's assistant musical director, Neil Eggle, and the orchestra performing Wallace Gilbraith's arrangement of White Christmas. Well, here's hoping for a white Christmas. I'm ready with my hat out in the snow to enjoy some snowball fights. Well, I hope you enjoyed that rendition of White Christmas though, and it's put you in the Christmas mood too. Earlier in September, we dipped our toes into the waters of live performance again with a concert in Newton Wollastown Church. It was our first gathering in nearly two years as far as the full orchestra concert is concerned. To date, that performance in Newton Wallastown Church has had nearly 10,000 views on our Facebook page and that's something we're immensely proud of. And we've chosen a piece from that concert for this festive celebration. It's a set of jigs arranged by Alistair McCulloch and includes the tunes Miss Sally Hunt Hunter of Thurston, Brian Germain of Westfield, Massachusetts and the Laird's Ferret. And it starts and finishes with the jig Dumfries House.
Well, I didn't think we'd be back here again, but here we are, and out of an abundance of safety and security, we've postponed our Christmas concert, but it's wonderful to get a chance to join you here instead to um, look back at some of the things we've done over the last few months um, and bring you, you something for this evening, and we can all look forward to being back in person live for our next concert, our next Christmas concert, which will be after Christmas. Um, but who doesn't love some Christmas music early in the year? Talking of Christmas music, the next thing we're going to play for you is a selection of three different Christmas tunes culminating in Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. So I hope you get your singing voices on and we can all join together for this wonderful Christmas medley. We were able to make use of technology to gather together when restrictions made in-person rehearsals impossible. And in October, we were able to use some of the IT skills we had learned to create a video to celebrate the 80th birthday of our founder, Wallace Goldbraith. The piece features an extract of Wallace and his sister Ina playing, followed by contributions from some 120 former and current players. Wallace's energy and enthusiasm has always been and continues to be an inspiration to all of us and we were delighted to mark his special birthday with a small token of our appreciation. Written by Alistair McCulloch, ladies and gentlemen, R. Wallace Gobraith, MBE.
it's been just wonderful to be all back together again, rehearsing in person in Kincase Church in Prestwick since August. However, it was great to be able to make use of Zoom all the way through the pandemic when we were all locked down in our houses to keep rehearsing and keep working together. This next piece we recorded all in our own houses individually and was wonderfully edited together by Neil and Kathleen. So here we go for The Northlands by John Mason. Well, thank you so much for joining us, everybody. It's been lovely to spend some time with you. Not how we planned, but it's certainly lovely to have spent some time with you. And we look forward to when our postponed concert actually happens to seeing you in real life in Air Town Hall. If you have enjoyed the concert tonight, um, it'd be lovely if you could head over to Just Giving uh, for a, a donation for the organisation of the orchestra and all the work that we do, we would hugely appreciate if you were able to do that. A massive thank you to both Kathleen and Neil for the huge amount of work they've put in to pulling together um, what we've been able to see um, in such a short period of time as well. So thanks so much, Kathleen and Neil. No Ayrshire Fiddle Orchestra Christmas celebration or event or anything is at all complete until we've heard Jingle Bells, particularly the fantastic arrangement 
by our founder and honorary president, Wallace Gilbraith. This is, I think, the finest example of an arrangement for a string orchestra that there is. So I thoroughly hope you enjoy Jingle Bells. Have a wonderful, safe, healthy and happy Christmas. A wonderful new year. And we look forward to seeing you in 2022. Merry Christmas, everyone. <laughs>